what do you do when you study? If your answer is sit in a quiet room and review your notes, you're in the minority. Every year, research studies are published indicating that more and more students are multitasking while doing schoolwork. Well, right now I am doing my How Things Works homework. I actually have Facebook up, but I'm trying really hard not to look at it. Um, my mom's texting me as well, which is kind of annoying, but oh well. And then I also have AIM up, but I don't really have any friends right now. And I also have my lesson plan up that's due tomorrow. That's, that's almost done. Cell phones? Instant messages, television, and music can all be distracting when you're trying to do your work. However, it's not too late to establish good study habits. Learning services, what we can do is we work one-on-one -on -one with students if they want to come in and work on how to break down their assignments uh, to smaller pieces. We do uh, peer tutoring, uh, so if you want to work with a student one-on-one -on, -one on how to break down the subject to read or if they want to work on study habits for getting prepared for the test, uh, and we also have writing consultants to work on papers if they have a science lab or an English paper they need help in. So basically, any aspect that you think you might need help, you can sign up for a tutor, but if you want one-on-one, -on -one, you can come see me. Some students have no problem concentrating on their work. The problem is finding the motivation to get started. Sometimes I have trouble starting my work because I go and I begin to listen to music and watch TV and go on the internet. Um, friends that want to hang out and watch TV, make them come over to the dorm rooms and hang out instead of coming over to other places, stuff like that. In order to cut down on end of the semester stress, make sure you keep track of assignments and due dates. Before sitting down to write that research paper, make sure you have all the books and other resources you might need. Keeping everything together from the start will help to keep your mind from wandering. Also, when studying or reading, try to avoid sitting or lying in your bed. Instead of reading, you might end up taking a nap. A recent study by the Kaiser Family Foundation shows that nearly two-thirds of all college students multitask while doing schoolwork. Let me call you back. By clearing your desk and your mind, you can be more efficient. For ECTV 40, I'm Stephen Giuliano.